your smartwatch. Here at Smart Monitor, we are constantly perfecting our products to provide additional value through improved functionality. For our users, this means the occasional software update. And in this video, we will try to make that process as seamless as possible. Before we start on anything, do not begin with your smartwatch plugged into the computer. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is actually download the upgrader. And to do that, you just got to go to your email that will have sent you, notifying you that there's an update for your smartwatch. Um, and in it, you'll find the URL that ends in .zip. You'll just plug that into your web browser, enter, and click Save. It'll ask you where do you want to save it. We will save it in the desktop just because that's easy to find, but you could save it anywhere else you wanted as long as you can find it again. We'll click Save. Okay, move this. Okay, back at our desktop, we see the zip file. And we are going to right click it and select Extract All. is going to be extracted to. We'll hit extract and you'll be prompted with a password uh, requirement and you can find this password again in your email about the update. I'll hit OK. Should take a minute to extract and copy the files over. Okay, here we have the smartwatch firmware installer. Uh, folder and we'll double click that and in the folder you'll see the .exe this is the actual installer for the upgrader and we are going to right click it and run it as an administrator okay in the wizard we're going to hit next first screen and then after that we're gonna hit install okay we'll click finish and we will get this prompt that says do you want to restart your computer which you should because for the software to install correctly, you need to restart. We'll hit yes. Once your computer has restarted and you have logged on, plug the charging clip into your PC. We're going to go over to the SW firmware icon. We're going to right click it and we're going to go down to properties. And in the window that appears, we'll go up to compatibility. Click on that go down to run the program as an administrator. Hit apply and then hit OK. Okay at this point we will attach the smartwatch to the charging clip and the computer will attempt to install a driver and this will usually be unsuccessful and that's okay. Once that message goes away we're gonna go over to the Windows icon, click on that and we're going to go to computer and we're going to right click and we're going to hit manage and then we're going to go up to the top left under and hit device manager and under other devices if you click on that you should see MSP4 30 application UART. If you don't see this, unplug the charging clip and plug it into a different USB port or restart the computer and try this over again. Now we're going to go click SW firmware icon on the desktop and then we're going to go to browse. Click on that. 
and we have to go locate our smartwatch firmware upgrader folder that we extracted earlier on the desktop. Here we see it, SW firmware upgrade. I'm gonna click on that. I'm gonna click on smartwatch firmware installer. Hit open. And then we're gonna actually find the, the update which is ending in dot hex. And we'll hit open. Hit update. We'll ask you if the file path is okay. You just hit yes. Then you have to wait a while. What usually happens is it'll take some time uh, to go from about 1% to 12%, but once you hit 12%, usually it speeds up pretty quickly. And when it finishes updating, it'll say, yay, you did it, you're done, and you can click OK. And all you have to do is click Cancel to exit out of the upgrader, and congratulations, you just updated your smartwatch.